What you doing? Are you kicking to paper? Kick, kick, kick. So, part of my no makeup. Oh, sorry. But my mom did my hair the other day. She did so good. Hi, Zoe. She did such a good job. It looks really good when it's all dry and straightened and I have makeup on. But, you know, today's a rainy day. So we're just hanging out. But Bobby had her appointment, her pediatrician appointment the other day. Say hi to the camera. Say hi to the camera. She had her appointment the other day and she, we found out that she has her dad's, so she has Tucker's sensitive skin. And so, um... She's like, if you look on her face really closely, see all that red and kind of flaky? Anyways, so we have to put some lotion on her, like, every few hours um, because she's getting little eczema spots on her arms and on her chest and back. It's sad, my poor little honey. Especially with winter coming, it's only going to get worse. Oh, are you getting hungry? And so, anyways, but her doctor, this lotion is actually really good. Um, it's this Sierra Vey. You probably can't see the top. Sierra V moisturizing cream, and it's really thick. It's really thick stuff, and um, it has no fragrance in it, which is really good. So I, I've actually been really liking that stuff. But um, we, my her pediatrician told us to get um, some different soap, like uh, told us to get Dove sensitive soap. And so um, I went to the store and bought some Dove sensitive soap. And I give her a bath, but it actually made her skin a lot more red, and I think it irritated it. And so my uh, sister actually makes um, soaps called, and they're goat milk soaps. So her store is called Stone River, um, Stone River Soaps, and she has some goats. And so what she does is that she makes goat milk soaps, and goat milk soap is actually really good. It's really um moisturizing for the skin it doesn't dry it out and things like that oh, no, you're getting hungry my honey um i might need to go feed her anyway so my sister's gonna send me some make some soap for for her skin and we're gonna try it out on her skin and see how that does anyways i'm gonna go feed my crying baby and i'll be back someone's hanging out in her bumbo are you hanging out in your bumbo honey <laughs> She's been getting so strong. Ah, huh, honey. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm back. And I figured I should get some makeup on. Anyways, so yeah. So my sister, you guys need to check her out. So she does all natural soaps. Um, and they smell amazing. Like she uses um, essential oils for a lot of them. And... They're just from her ghosts, and like I was saying, they're really moisturizing. Like my, like my skin gets a little irritated with, um, like, it, well, not irritated. It just dries out, and so when I use like soap bought from the store, my skin is a lot drier than compared to using her soap. So I'll show you some. Um, anyways, they're so cool. So these are some. I'm letting these ones dry out a little bit more. So, got this one. This is like a raspberry one. Uh, this, oh, this one's one of my favorite. It has, I think she called it, like, avocado something. I'm not sure. Anyways, but it has these little teeny green little bits in it. And so it's awesome for exfoliating. And then this one is amazing. It's a men um, scent one. And so it's Tabasco oil and coffee grounds. And it is, it's an awesome smell. And then this one. It's her awesome fall one. I think it's, I smell cinnamon. I think it's cinnamon and pumpkin. I'm not sure though, but I know it's cinnamon. So anyway, so she's going, she made some, she makes some charcoal, um, charcoal ones for like the face, for sensitive face, because charcoal's really good. So she's gonna send me um, some charcoal that I can start using on her. And then she's gonna make some um, unscented goat milk baby soaps for me that I can try on her skin since her skin's so sensitive. Hi, sweet girl. Are you kicking, kicking? So I'm really excited to get it. So check her out. It's called Stone River Soaps. Um, I'll put it here and in the link below so you can check her out because she's way awesome. So anyways. What you doing? Are you kicking to paper? Kick, kick, kick. 
If any of if any of you have zero to three month old babies, these are some awesome activities that you can do for like sensory things. Is have them kick. I've had her sit up in the bumbo to strengthen up her neck and play with her toy, as well as I'll. I will set her on her belly on these and kind of lean her over so it helps strengthen up her neck and then put toys under her. Um, but if you don't have like tissue paper like this, you can also um, loosely tie balloons, like balloon strings around their, her ankles or ankles, just really loosely, like obviously not tight, so that once they kick their legs that the balloons move. And so anyways, these are some awesome sensory things that you guys can do for some little babies to build it all up and do some tummy time. and. And I read a cool article that said if you, like, with seats like this and, like, car seats, if you leave them in there, like, super long, it can actually, obviously, it gets them, like, flat head. Um, but it also can, turn you towards me, but it also can make it so, like, they have a harder time with, like, sitting up because their neck is always being supported. And so you always want to, like, I always set her on my lap and not support her neck. Um, and just like hold her there and like sometimes her neck wobbles, but she's actually been she's actually really strong with her neck She can hold her neck up really well um, So anyways, but yeah check out these fun exercises that I can do. Can you smile? Can you smile for the camera, honey? Are you gonna talk to us? Talk and talk and talk and talk Talk and talk Yeah, but anyway anything like even though she can't fully like grab these toys up just hearing them and kind of hearing the sounds helps with all their sensory development. Um, and kicking, obviously, kicking things like this. And she's always moving. I'm not, like, could you not? Since the day she was born, she has, she doesn't hold still. Like, she only will hold still if she's, like, really tired and about to fall asleep. But um, other than that, she's constantly, I'm going to take this back up. She's constantly kicking her arms, her legs. She's, like, always moving it is the funniest thing like I've never hi I said you over I've never met a baby that moves as much as she does like she is like everyone says that whoever holds her they'll be like wow she has not stopped moving I'm like I know my baby does not stop moving she's like her dad she's like her daddy always always moving huh hi don't mind my crazy hair mess I haven't gotten ready for the day yet um, but anyways, we had a, an awesome weekend. We watched general conference and hung out with family and um, made breakfast, had some friends come over. It was really nice to just take a weekend to relax and kind of chill and be with family and friends. Anyways, so I hope you guys liked our video for this week. Uh, make sure you subscribe, so hit that subscribe button. And you know, also check out our Facebook page. Um, this is Tucker and Kara, uh, Facebook change, uh, Facebook page page oh my gosh but I will be changing it actually to the forward family and I was we have some very exciting things going to be coming up soon so watch out for those because I got to get it ready we're not ready yet but there are some very exciting things coming our way so anyways I hope you guys had an awesome weekend and an awesome week and we'll catch you next week see ya